Aloha, folks. I hope you're having a great day. Hey, I'm outside here in front of the chapel by this big Norfolk pine. There's a little story behind this. We planted this the very first year that we came here to Molokai. So it's, it's about 25 years old, at least. And when we planted it, it was this tiny little tree. And now it's huge. I, I have no idea how tall it is, but it goes way up. Look at how big this thing is. Just a massive tree. Psalm 1, 1 through 3, it says this, Oh, the joys of those who do not follow the advice of the wicked, or stand around with sinners, or join in mockers, but they delight in the law of the Lord, meditating on it day and night. They're like trees planted along the riverbank, bearing fruit each season. Their leaves never wither, and they prosper in all they do. God likens a righteous person to a strong tree, a tree that's roots go down deep and its foliage goes out lush and green. Folks, that's what he's calling us to be. He's calling us to be righteous people that stand firm on his truth and in his ways, just like a strong, mighty tree. Every time I look at this tree, I'm I'm just um, amazed at how much it's grown over the years, how strong it's gotten, how tall it's gotten. Man, that's how we should be as we grow in our Christian walk, growing stronger, deeper roots every year that we live. Righteous people growing in God's truth. Hey, I want to tell you, I've got a couple of great things coming up. First, the women's Christmas dinner, Sunday the 13th, just a couple weeks away, ladies. And you got to sign up this year because of uh, the COVID restrictions and different things. We're going to have to do the dinner different this year. And one of the things that's very important is you can't just show up. You got to sign up because we have to put you in special groups. So if you forgot to sign up this past Sunday, good news. You can do it this Sunday. It's coming up two weeks, December 13th, Women's Christmas Dinner. And then we're starting a brand new series this Sunday just for Christmas. It's just going to be the next few weeks. It's called The Savior Has Been Born. And we're going to be looking at what that means, that we have a Savior, that the Savior was born. I hope you'll be here this Sunday and each Sunday right up through the Christmas holidays. Well, as we close out our time together, let me remind you of our theme verse. Romans 12, 12, rejoice in our confident hope. Be patient in trouble and keep on praying. Hope you have a great week and hope to see you on Sunday.